James Allen wrote a wonderful book on this Bible quote, and if you can ever pick it up, do so. It is on the Bible quote of Proverbs 23, verse 7. For as he thinketh in his heart, so is he. I pray today that you are empowered with a new level of thinking in you, that it becomes part of you, part of you so much that you feel it. Thinking and feeling together is your heart spiritually inside of you. And I pray that you are able to think only kind and harmonious thoughts. Now, there may be times when it seems difficult to keep your thoughts kind and in harmony, yet there is a way to develop a harmony in your thinking. How do you do this? Well, you do it by letting go of thoughts of unforgiveness and anger and then focusing on the power of God that is within you, that is thinking through you. When you focus on God, you're directed in your thoughts and you're directed in godly ways, in loving ways, in harmony ways. You're allowing God's love to work in and through you to guide you in every experience of life. And by following God's direction, you're gaining mastery over your thoughts and you're helping to dissolve unkindness in the world. Whenever you need more harmony in your thinking and in your life, Turn to God in prayer. Let's do so right now. Dear God, I open my mind and I open my heart to the unlimited flow of your unconditional love. As I hold to thoughts of your good, dear God, I behold the good coming forth into my life. I pray that I constantly keep my mind and heart open, that I constantly allow you to come through that openness, that that transforms me and transforms my thinking into an unconditional love. I hold today to thoughts of your good, And I behold that good coming forth into my life through me, through my thinking, through my actions as I concentrate and center only on you. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen.